love saying hi on Tuesday on our Zoom meeting. And I thought we would sing hello to each other now too. Can you clap your laps? Clap your laps. Clap your laps. Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? How are you today? It's nice to see Evelyn. It's nice to see Lila K. It's nice to see Lila B. How are you today? It's nice to see Jason. It's nice to see Hadara. It's nice to see Jordy. How are you today? It's nice to see Haley. It's nice to see Ruth. Ben, it's nice to see Sydney Bachman. How are you today? It's nice to see Sydney Bendick. It's nice to see Logan. It's nice to see Emma. How are you today? It's nice to see Miss Jenny. It's nice to see Miss Debbie. It's nice to see Miss Allison. How are you today? Yay! Did you sing with me? You sing hello to all your friends. So friends, today I thought we would do something different. I thought we would do yoga today. Has anyone ever done yoga before? We never did it together in class, right? But I like to do yoga, so I thought maybe we'd do a little short yoga session together. Friends, before we start, can you sit crisscross applesauce like me? Your legs are crisscross and your hands are together at your heart. This is our yoga position. I like to call this the peaceful piggy position. I have a little piggy that I usually use for yoga. And the piggy likes to sit with its hands together and its legs crisscross applesauce. Can you do that? Nice. Now can you shake it out? Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, and peaceful piggy. Did you do it? Let's try it again. Ready? One, two, three. Shake everything. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake, it. shake your head, shake your hands, everything. And peaceful piggy, nice. Can we also practice our breathing? Because there's so much good breathing when we do yoga. Can you pick a flower? Let's pretend there's a big flower patch, like a garden you might see outside when you go for a walk. Let's pick a flower. Oh, do you have your flower? Mine is a red flower. What color is yours? Let's take a deep sniff. Let's smell the flower, but take a really deep sniff. Ready? One, two, three. Can you smell it again? Ready? One, two, smell your flower. <sighs> that felt good. So now that we learned our peaceful piggy and we learned our flower breathing, I want to show you this book. This book is called Good Morning Yoga. And this friend in the book is going to do all sorts of yoga positions and I thought we would try them too. Will you try with me? See what happens. I'm gonna go back on my yoga mat. This is my yoga mat. You don't have to have a yoga mat, but if you do, it's nice to do yoga on your yoga mat. Good morning, yoga. Let's see what this friend is gonna do. Let's try to do the same things with our body that the friend in the book is doing. My first breath is long and deep. Can you stand up and do a long deep breath and reach your hands up to the sky? Let's do it, ready? Did you do it with me? Are your hands all the way up to the sky? Nice job. Let's see what else this friend does. I twist and turn to shake off sleep. Can we twist and turn? Let's stand up. Let's take our arms and let's twist them. Oh, that feels good. And turn, and twist, and turn. Good job. Let's see what else this friend does. Today, I'm a fiery volcano reaching high. You did that, right? Let's see what else we can do. A brave ski jumper ready to fly. Friends, look at this. This friend is skiing. Do you want to try it with me? Okay, can you stand up? And can you reach your hands up high? 
And now can you bend your knees and pretend like you're skiing? Can you do it with me? Oh, that's so hard, it's not easy. Good job. Let's see what comes next. Oh, we just did this too. A lightning bolt flash across the sky. Today, I'm also a mountain, quiet and still. Friends, this is called a mountain pose. Do you see this little friend? Let's try the mountain pose. So a mountain pose is really tall and strong. Your hands are at your side, your feet are together. And you're so tall and strong that if I tried to push you down, you wouldn't fall because your body is so tall and strong. Can you stand up really tall? Good job. See what else this friend can do. A gentle stream flowing downhill. So let's get back into mountain pose. So tall and strong, let's reach our hands up. And let's be like a river and fold over. Nice job, friends. Nice job. A playful dog stretching with skill. Do you know this pose? It's called a downward dog pose. Can we try it together? Can you try a downward dog? Put your hands on the floor, bring your feet on the floor, and lift up for a downward dog. Can you lift up one leg and shake your tail? Woof, woof, woof. And can you lift up the other leg and shake the other tail? Good job, doggies. Let's see what comes next. Crossing bridges on the path I take. Let's try a bridge pose, friends. Can you lie down? Let's lie all the way down on our backs. And your feet are on the floor. And can you lift up your bottom like a bridge? And hold it, hold it, hold it. And come down. Good job, friends. Sailing boats on the journeys I make. Can we make our bodies look like a boat? Let's make our bodies look like a boat. So we're gonna sit on our bottoms. Put your feet on the floor and your hands on the floor. And can you lift up your legs? Can you lift up one hand? Can you lift up the other hand? Can you hold it for one, two, three, four, five? Good job. It's nice boats. You look just like a boat when you did that. Calm and awake. I can do this is all I need to say. A deep breath in and a deep breath out. I am ready for the day. The end. Good job, everybody. That was a little short yoga session. And I love to do yoga. If we were in school together, we would do lots of yoga together. But we're at home, right? So I thought we can do it at home. And if you like this, we can do it more often and we can do different things. That was so much fun. Thank you for joining me. We miss you. We can't wait to see you soon. Have a good day, everybody. Bye.